Ladies and gentlemen, welcome once again to Postcard Marketing 2019, where you get to learn all the very best techniques and programs in all of uh, 2019 for Postcard Marketing 2019. It was uh, 2019 a very big year for Postcard Marketing. And the first 10 videos I had in here Pretty much uh, the first ones explained some basic techniques that were very, very powerful. I went on to describe in the post-marketing 2019 series through that 10 of introducing you to the two most powerful cash in your mailbox programs. And uh, I explained about the autoresponder and all kinds of secrets of marketing, especially in the postcard marketing 2019 techniques and what was used in 2019. Various, uh, several to many uh, techniques used to make incredible amounts of money both in not just getting more leads, but in more conversions, which is very, very powerful. And then in the number 11 video training, post-market training, I had explained about some various, uh, one very important new, to me, was a new discovery about text marketing and how to use it. And what i would given you was some information that actually through a program, a software program, you could actually go ahead and literally do just about everything that you could on, uh, you know, the uh, AWeber autoresponder and all that kind of stuff. Now, eventually I'm going to get into that a lot more, but for now, I just wanted to go through that, give you kind of a review. In the very last video that you saw, if you did see it, please go see it if you haven't seen it yet. Uh, some of you uh, folks are new subscribers. You've only seen a video from what I might have advertised somewhere else, and uh, that's all you've seen. You haven't seen the beginnings from uh, first was the trailer to this channel. And then there was an introduction video. And then there was the uh, training one, post-marketing training number one. And what happens is sometimes YouTube doesn't show the very first video. So just go on my channel where you see the word playlist there in your selections and click on it. And you will see, uh, you can hover over the little square, like film box, or the words below it, where it says play all. Or hover the mouse over that, say play all. And on the right hand corner, it will show you um, all the various, uh, all the way from the trailer on, complete. It will show you a complete list, so that way you won't miss anything. Now, from the last video, I was giving you some very, very special offline techniques that are not really had anything to do with Postcard Marketing 2019. I just wanted to give you that as a bonus. I gave you three powerful ways of uh, marketing, and I had a surprise one we didn't have time for, and I'm continuing that here. And what that is, and this is incredible. It's another uh, combination postcard and flyer marketing. But if you can imagine if you have one of those slings that goes around your neck and it's like a pouch, a carry-all pouch. Now you're going to have a box open or a couple boxes of postcards in there. And you're going to go to a ball game like a baseball game, football game, rugby game, where everybody in the audience, a, a real live game, you go there and it'll be worth it for the money, for the postcards, and worth it to pay for the game because what's going to happen is every time somebody scores a point, you throw a whole bunch of these 
little business cards up in the air. And they go flying everywhere. And it's just like graffiti. But here's the thing. They have your advertising on them with your link in there. Either your website link or whatever you're going to uh, put in there. Your, we talked about the gate or whatever you're going to do. Or your text, texting phone number. Whatever you want. Whatever you want to advertise. And people are going to look at that. They're going to see that. And they're going to see instead of regular graffiti. They're going to be curious. And they're going to pick one up and see what that's about. Now there you go. That's the lead. If that person puts that postcard in their pocket for later when they get home or to the office or wherever where they can check that out, that's a hot lead. Oh yeah, that's really good. Now, imagine if you had a thousand or a couple thousand postcards here stuffed in this pouch. And every time, it didn't matter which, which team you're rooting for, but every time a team, either on the left or the right, whatever, Whoever scores, people jump up, they go crazy, throw some of them cards like crazy. And watch, you stop at the top of the you start at the top of the stadium and you get it all figured out ahead of time where one of the exits is. You gotta start at the top, way up here, and you gotta circle around, down, 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 till towards the end of the game you're just about by the exit. And then what happens? Right before the game goes out, you go ahead and you exit. And you wait out there, outside the exit, you know, 100 feet, a couple hundred feet away. You could be, you know, a quarter block away. And when people come out, see, you've already now left the game, a few minutes remaining or whatever to give you enough time to go to your vehicle. And instead of postcards, it's cheaper if you want to. You can use the postcards, but it's cheaper than from that point to use fires, which you can't exactly throw them up in the air, but you can stand there outside the exit of the ballpark and hand out flyers. Here, free, here, 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 free, free. And people look and you put it close enough to them, their automatic response is either to push it away or take it. And if they're friendly, they usually take it. They take it. They see other people take it. It's free. They take it. They take it. People love free. Free stuff. And there you have it. You can put out like a thousand to ten thousand, you know, total cards, uh, bus uh, business cards and fires in just a handful of hours or less. And that's like a thousand or several thousand hot leads that are going to check out your website or whatever you got. So, now for the wording that usually goes in the description box down below from the last video, the remainder, what wouldn't fit in there, now I've put down here for you to see because like I said earlier, it's important that you see the videos and the complete description because I try and put down what I'm saying on the videos into that box. Sometimes uh, YouTube won't let me, it only gives you like 500 characters or whatever, so you run out of room for writing. So if it's a 15 minute video, you know, there's quite a bit in there. Sometimes I've been moving it into the next video, like this is a short video. Well, in the last video, I did everything mostly in the videos, but you only got to see like the first one third of that wording and writing. Sometimes writing is not exactly the same as what's in the video and I want you to see it all. Because I don't sit here and read right from a script, you know, I don't do that. I try and do it here, make it fresh and exciting for you. But I don't want to forget anything, so I write down a script too. That way you got it from both sides of the story. So you get everything full, complete training. So I hope you like this. And please continue on. If you haven't already subscribed, please go below. Do that. Feel free to give a big thumbs up. Leave a nice comment. And we'll see you in the next video training. Thank you.